Now, as we look at, you know, the NFL, you know, past the uh, the halfway mark here, if I were to say who is the MVP, uh, my vote would be Andrew Luck. Now, I know, now I know that won't be the case. It would probably be a guy like Pat Mahomes or Drew Brees. But at the very le least, Andrew Luck should be considered to be an NFL MVP. A couple of things here. Andrew Luck, I think, is just doing amazing things. He has a revamped offensive line, new head coach. When his, when his offensive line actually blocks for him, and he has more than two seconds to throw, he doesn't get injured, and he's a top-five quarterback in the league. Listen, he definitely, without a doubt, deserves comeback player of the year. And, listen, if the Colts make the playoffs, give him the MVP. He should be, at the very least, considered for it. He doesn't have the weapons that a Mahomes, and he doesn't have the weapons that a Drew Brees has. He is most valuable to me. You might be saying luck is a turnover machine. T.Y. Hilton is one of the best receivers in the game, and Eric Ebron is establishing himself as one of the best tight ends in football. Listen, they weren't doing anything, anything last year with Jacob Brissett, a quarterback. Andrew Luck is throwing bullets right in these guys' hands, making them good players. Yes, T.Y. Hilton is a talented receiver, but Andrew Luck is a big part of him having a very good year. Now he's saying 12 turnovers. Uh, and, and, you know, turnovers. Here's the thing. Okay, he, he does. Now, The thing is, okay, a lot of people, a lot of people, listen, didn't his skill guys lead the NFL in drops at one point in Andrew Lux? Half of his interceptions have been off tipped balls that the receivers should have caught. Point is, he is doing more with less than the other top quarterbacks. They these these balls they just bounce off their hands. Bounce off their hands. Listen. At least half of Lux interceptions, I would say, are off tip passes. Past five games, he has a sixteen to three ratio. His receivers was dropping so much the first half of the year, and he turned it over and turned it around, and he's been phenomenal. Phenomenal. Again, I could see the argument for a Drew Brees and a Pat Mahomes. That's the popular argument. But do not sleep. On Andrew Luck. And, you know, he does not have the defense either. He does not. And Luck is very uh, competitive uh, when it comes to that touchdown stats. Why not, Andrew Luck? And, and it just uh, says a lot that uh, he was able to come back from 
where he was. Listen, here's this. Let's put Mahomes on Indy. And all the Colts all of a sudden 9-2. and two. Now let's put Luck on Kansas City. All the Chiefs fighting for a playoff spot. Sitting at 6-5. and five. I think we know the answer to that. I hope all is well. I look forward to speaking to you guys very, very soon. Listen to Sleep on this. Luck has more touchdowns than Breeze in almost the same yardage. You know, Mahomes has also choked in back to back series in the playoff type game. Not to mention he has six turnovers. Last minutes of the game, I would take luck over Mahomes. That's what you got to do. I hope all is well. Look forward to speaking to you guys very, very soon.